So multiple myeloma is a proliferation of plasma cells which tends to accumulate in the bone marrow, destroy the vertebrae which people can present with back pain. When there is a destruction of the vertebrae, it leads to more of calcium leading to choking of kidneys. So how does the multiple myeloma patient present? It can present to a nephrologist by unexplained renal failure. It can present to a spinal problem or a neurosurgeon with broken spine or a lytic lesion. This is how a patient of multiple myeloma goes to you. So any unexplained renal failure, back pain or high ESR or anemia is multiple myeloma. How do we diagnose? Is by seeing serum protein electrophoresis. In 2001, in multiple myeloma, there was only 5 medications. In 2018, there are 17 medications which can help you from 15% to 95% people can get control with multiple myeloma. Multiple myeloma cannot be cured today, but it can be controlled by virtue of a targeted medication like bortezomab, daratumumab, calfizumab, pomalidomide, which are so specific that they only go and kill the plasma cells. But what is more important to understand that every patient up to 65 years of age needs to get a bone marrow transplant done which is an autologous transplant because it prolongs their disease free survival. It prevents the early disease relapses and ushers us into 2020 or 2023 where we might have a drug which might cure them.